Hello everyone once again. This is Daniel. And um I just decided to make two videos in one, but they're four now, but anyway, <laughs> you'll understand later on. Okay. So what is who is God really? What is his uh, own attrib attribute? This is a shorter version of the other one, but okay. So where's the Holy Spirit? He is actually all over the place. As you can see. He is holding the earth together. He is holding my he was holding my foot together. My skin, as you can see, my skin is being held together and nothing can come off of it except for dust. And um like I said, the Holy Spirit is actually the equivalent 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 of air. He is a smoke, he is the water, he is a fire, he is so basically he is uh, air, smoke, fire, um, cloud, and um, water. So air, smoke, fire, cloud, and water. He is five things. But he actually is seven things. He is also part dark and part light. Because the light of him is shining around, around us. That's the Holy Spirit. That is the mystery of the Holy Spirit. Um, so as you can see, he's holding my skin together, but he's also holding the tree together. Look how hard it is for me to get that, um, see how hard it is to get that, well, it's hard to get the bark off, and I felt bad to get the bark off. <laughs> Sorry. But still, the Holy Spirit is around us all over the place. He is abound all in every place in the whole crevice of the earth. And he's working so hard to keep everything alive. He's worked so hard. He's worked so, so hard just to keep me together and to keep this earth together. Since by his word, by his own word, by Jesus, by the command of his father, did he create this rock and hold it together. And he, anything that, uh, how do you explain that? He, he just can't. Because all of his work and effort is to keep everything together. He is life. He is my lungs and life. He, he makes me breathe. I mean, the coming breath of God that keeps you alive. I mean, the breath of God, um, the Holy Spirit, or something like that, I don't know. You never know what the Holy Spirit really is, but he is a spirit. He is all around us. He surrounds the whole entire earth and keeps it together. That's all I can say. <laughs> so, anyway, we don't really know how he does it, but I mean, look at all this grass. That makes me a whole lot of work. Just holding all this grass skull together. So, the Holy Spirit, he really works so hard on us. And since he, the first seven days, or the first 7,000 years, he was working so hard on humanity. 6,000 years it took for him, or days, for him to create the creation. Then by the 7,000th year, he rested. Then we came. So it will be 12,000 years before he is able to um, really work on things by the 6,000th year by a man. Then 1,000 years more, you have to keep on working to keep man in its place. Then by the 14,000th year is a great rest. So there's a, the rest for the day, and then there's a great rest for, for forever. But it doesn't stop there. His rest is to keep us together by his own rest. Like dolphins, literally resting but literally awake. Like um, humans singing, but thinking about something else, and they don't know what they're singing, but they're literally singing, if you know what I mean. So his rest is not a rest. It's actually subconscious rest that knows what he's doing by holding things together. Our Holy Spirit is so loving. This is why we must respect the Holy Spirit, because to mock the Holy Spirit causes death is the only unforgivable sin because 
That will make him really cry. It will make him really cry when you mock him. Because when people mock the Holy Spirit, he utterly cries. I don't know. But it seems like um, when people mock God, he really cries. I mean, Jesus is supporter of uh, is supported by the Father. And, you know, when they made the um, what was the movie called? I I don't know what the movie was called. The Star, maybe, but yeah, the Star. But when they made that when they move when they made, uh, when they made that movie. Rivers. It was rivers and streams. It was the unbearable thought of when it, when is this going to stop? But he knew it wasn't going to stop because he knew he had to get more people. That was the time when God wanted to. Um, he he felt like he couldn't wait anymore. It, it will take someone. It'll take something in a line of mocking the Holy Spirit by movie. To make him say, I'm done, I quit on humanity. Because this is what he does. He holds things together and he creates life. And not only does he do, do that, but he also rules. He does everything for us. He is a prime ruler of the whole entire universe. I mean, in hell we'll be dust. No, we'll be dozen skeletons. Because he is perfect. The Holy Spirit is everything amazing. He is everything perfect. You know, he's beginning and end. And he is life. Our God is life. So if you're going to mess with him, you're going to mess with the wrong God. Because he's going to take your life away. That's all I can say. All right, I'll be done now, okay? Bye.